Hey guys, I go here. Welcome back to more. Let's play Legends of the Bash. I don't know why I said it all so fast. Anyway. So anyway, I think to fight this boss, all you want to do, well, is one, get as far as away as you can from him. Keep your light arrows charged up. Do that. Oh, yeah, just get, basically get rid of all the bats. And just shoot him. Wow, he's dodging them all like crazy. See, I knew he was gonna dodge, but... And I'm pretty sure these pots around the room have magic. No, actually, to get magic, just wait for him to send a, a swarm of bats after you. And when they come towards you, just spin attack. That would give you arrows and hopefully magic, which it did right there. Go to the bats. And attack them. Dodge. Shoot. There. Thing is, you probably could have beat that boss in the last minute. It's funny how he has a Stalfos there. I believe the ones with the shield and swords are called Stalfos. While the ones. Well, there is a treasure chest through, uh, no, through this room. And you know what this is, guys? This is the boss key! Which means we made it to the boss! And we're missing how many fairies? I believe, like, three? Yeah, three, and two of them I know where they are. I think, I think we got them all, guys. Wow! I'm actually proud of myself. I was able to beat this temple with no guide. Like seriously, I don't have a guide open. I just have audacity, and that's it. And I've been jinx again. <sighs> oh, I can't count my chickens yet because we haven't beat the dungeon yet. Anyway. Oh yeah, I forgot, we have to... See, we're not done yet, we still have to... Basically, flip the dungeon un upside down... And get two... Fairies. I think what I might do is beat the temple... And then when we get teleported outside... I can come back in and get the two last three fairies... Because I think the... Thing we set itself... And that can... That's what I might do. Because the both of them are on the... Two of them are actually on one side. That is a bright sun. But to be honest, the sun looks pretty beautiful. This game has gorgeous graphics for you. I could I could have sworn there's a fairy. If I'm missing one, I'm going to bet it's in there. Okay, we're back here. So let's find out what this does. That is death. Nothing but death. So these guys, because we need whole magic anyway. Wait, no, we don't want to do that. Is there a faster way back into that room? And I'm just being a dum dum. I guess I'll just backtrack all the way. Actually, no, I don't want to stand here.
I was say, can I use a gorn mask? <laughs> to be honest, I can just walk across this. It's not like it's gonna instantly kill me. It's just gonna... Well, well real life, I would've had my... Uh... Shins ripped off. Shins. I would've had... Uh... My legs... Melted. Making it impossible to walk. But in the world of all these other boots... Make everything better. Okay, going through this will make us bring us to the main room. Which I believe if we where is no that's over here. Equip this. So we're gonna go closer to it. I think like right here is good enough. Yeah, shoot this and it will come up here, which will bring us to this door, which we have to fight this guy. I don't have a light arrow. No, actually we have no magic for this, so I want to leave and then grab some magic. I just want to think of where some of the fairies are. That's probably one. I'm trying to think of where, like, I know we opened up another treasure somewhere. We went through that. Are you serious? I could flip it upside right, right now and go get those. You no, know, let's do that since I'm already here. And then we can beat the boss in this temp uh, video, which is, I believe, video four? I don't know. I could check right now. Why don't I just do that? And why did I put the Keaton mask on? Okay, hold on. Let me see what uh, video number this is. Yeah, this is four, so I can beat the boss in this video. We're kind of on track. I have to do all of this? Again? Ah. I'll meet you guys back inside. Okay, back in here. We can come down here. Pick up this. Giving us our 13th Street Fairy. I think they go back into. I think it was. Was it the water room? No. Room was that actually? And there's this room. That has a treasure chest, right? Oh, wait. No, this was the room, yeah. So let's dive on in. Don't lock on to stuff. And this is, yep, this is the next one. Now, gotta think, where is the last tree fairy? Let 
There's only two rooms left. And... Is in there, so I have to go completely around. So I'm gonna go completely around and meet you guys back here again. In the, in the room before this, because I think that's where it is. I have to do this again. I, mm. Okay, so I made it back in this room, but. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I was like, there's no way to get out. So, I guess the treasure chest is in there, and I don't think we can get to it. So, I think we have to be on the other side, but it's fine because... Because we have to go on that side anyway, we got the other stuff in here. So, that was a long journey. It also says there's a treasure chest in here. But I don't know how. Because if that treasure chest in there is not the straight fairy, then I don't know what that is. Or how to get that one, I should say. So, we have to go flip the thing again. So, I would say I'll meet you in all the room, but I'm not going to worry about it. Wait a minute. Could that tre Oh, that's what that is. That treasure chest is just... The room we were just in. It's upside down, that's why. Never mind, I know what that treasure chest is now. So I think, yeah, we just got everything done. To be honest, that is the fastest way to do it is left, right, left, right, then didn't go in a full circle. Actually, right, left, right. See, I got my left and rights mixed up. I don't know why, I keep wanting to say left. Are you serious? Oh no, upside down we go. Thank you, I started this recording like an hour ago. Since we did four videos, four times two. It's eight, so we've been recording for an hour and twenty minutes. Technically, I have got some twenty-five minute long videos and stuff. I don't really remember how much episodes we recorded, but... So here, let's go on this side. Get a grappling hook. Get a little bit closer. Is there something behind us? We're gonna go through this. Oh, we need magic. Should have picked up some magic. But I'm pretty sure we can beat him with. Are you serious? I think what we can do, yeah, is this. So we don't actually need magic. There we go. Anyway, beat him. Hopefully the treasure chest is not up there. Actually, you can't because there's no way to get this. No, actually there is. Let's just be glad. Anyway, this is the last mask. Now, this mask is only used in this temple, I guess you say. And instead of making another bonus video of finding this temple's boss with this mask, I'm just going to do it now. I know it's just because I want to get the thing done faster. But, 
Do I hit this? Did I make a chest spawn on the other side? Oh, uh, we're gonna get that treasure chest uh, later. The reason why I say that is because I want to beat the temple, I'll be rise it up again, and then we'll just grab it like that. So let's uh, lock the boss door and fight. Th oh my God! Is I realize something? You need magic to fight the boss. To use that mask. We don't got magic, so we find the boss normally. Oh, it's a worm, but wait, there's two of them. Giant mass insect. Twin mold. So, what do you have to do on this fight? Um, be careful. If you're using the giant's mask, you can walk off the uh, stage. So, what you want to do is basically shoot them with arrows. And you want to shoot basically like the tail. And when they get close to you, of course you can just do this. So, you don't actually need. I just recommend staying on the platform, because if you walk too far out, it will glitch you out, and you will fall through the sand. I say, look, watch where the bolts are coming from, see where they're going. And you can... Really? Spare arrows! Actually, no! This is spin attack. Okay, I hit, I hit him though. Since he's coming by, we could do a spin attack. And hopefully hit him. Oh no, I didn't hit him. Oh, at least we hit him still. Oh, we missed that one. For a second, I thought it was a treasure chest. I was like, how? Nope. We hit him again. Oh, we hit him! Yay! This is gonna take a while. Especially if we run out of magic. Oh man, we could have shot him there. The way out there for some strange reason. Oh no, he's getting close. Wait, we can shoot a face? No, I'm actually gonna walk out into the sand. Spin attack! Wait, no, it's gonna come out. Just keep on spinning attack! Okay. Got this, guys. Wait, no, he's coming right here. So we can... No, I couldn't do it in time. Another hit. I would have loved to do this with that mask. The giant's mask, uh, all it does is transforms you big. I guess I gotta do an extra bonus video. Not a problem, but uh... Are you serious? I missed the shot. Oh, dang. This we can... Are you serious? They hit me... Force me not to... Uh... So we hit him. My god, we're out of arrows too. 
I know they want you to use the giant's mask, but they should have gave us magic for four of them. To be honest. Well, technically they kind of did, and I just was being silly. I don't think this is going to hit. Oh my god, this is going to take forever. Keep spinning! Spin! Ugh, this is not going to work. I have to get so close to him. And it still doesn't hit him. Oh my goodness. It's not even hitting him. And we have no magic. So how are we supposed to fight this thing? Blast mass maybe? Basically just go where they're gonna they're gonna be. And just wait. Nah, that didn't work. Well, I hit him. So I keep hitting him and this is not working. La 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 la. Oh, we can hit him twice because he wouldn't like in a U shape. Or da 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 la la because that's not going to work. Oh, we killed one of them. I wish you could drop arrows or, you know, some magic. Please. So defeating one doesn't really mean we're good. We have to defeat both of them. Oh, we defeated both of them. Nice, yes. We just hit the 30 minute mark. So the seven uh, videos, we have three videos left to record. We can do it. Oh, and by the way, the reason why I said three is because I thought because I have to do the Andre's Cafe side quest again. So it's going to be a lot of editing in that episode. Because I want to show cutscenes that we haven't seen yet. So, three episode. We can still do this. Yep, we totally can. Of course, I gotta get that last straight fairy. Well, we've helped all of you. That's all, all we can do. Call us. That is what they're saying. Without being told, we understand. So we'll help without us. We'll call from the top of the clock tower. So do something about him, alright? What? Their voices sound sad. You don't want to? For... Give... Your friend... Forgive our friend? What do you mean by forgive? And that is all the evil curses. Oh, 
Okay, we're back in Inca Canyon, but real quick, I want to cut back into the temple and get the last straight fairy. And it's still upside down. And there is no pots. So, no magic. Great. Okay. Inside this chest is the last straight fairy. So, anyway, next time on Let's Play The Legend, Legend of Zelda, Majora's Mask, we'll do everything. I'll see you guys later.